Hey Alphys, what's going on? Good morning. It looks like we're gonna have a better day today, so let's shoot for not having a car vlog. I'm gonna see if I can take some time off from work today just to um, spend some time with you. I'm really ready to get the day started. I feel energized. I feel good. I feel I just I just feel I'm in, I'm in such a good mood and I don't know if some of it was the movie I saw last night because that movie honestly put me in a pretty decent mood and uh, I really highly recommend that you guys see the choice if you have an opportunity yeah it's a chick flick yeah okay it is a chick flick however it has such a great message that I encourage all people to see it especially couples so let's get the day started so I'm here at Sam's Club and I got some dying light, a lot of dying light. So let me say this, sometimes life can be really trying. Life can be very interesting and life can definitely deal you a lot of blows that you're not expecting it to, to deal you. And. It's how we deal with those situations really, like I've said in another video, really what shapes you. So, deal with the mantra that I deal with, please. And live life out of love and not fear or anger. When I do things with my life, I try to live life out of love. I always try to do things out of love, any decision, that I make, I try to make it out of love. Even when I'm angry, even when I'm upset, even when I'm sad, even when I'm going through those things, I try to live my life and guide my life out of love. I don't try to do it out of fear or anger because when you do that, it causes you to make fatal mistakes in your life. And I don't mean fatal by dying, I mean fatal by events that you cannot come back from. Saying things that you can no longer change or or apologize for there's certain things in life when you say something you can't take it back there's certain things you just can't take back or bring back or recover from so be careful about what you say be careful about what you do in this life because if you don't live it out of love and try to make those decisions that's in benefit of yourself and your fellow man you will regret it. You will regret everything that you do from that point forward, I assure you. So please, when you're dealing with people, when you're dealing with your family, even when you're dealing with your pets, live that love. Don't live that fear, don't live that anger. And it's interesting, because if you deal with your pets, your pets will really show you who you are. Because if you try to pet, your dog or your cat and they cower from you a little bit it really should show you that you're, you're mistreating them or you're not treating them the way they should be treated and you might be treating people that same way I'm very serious about what I'm saying because I literally had an event where it didn't happen to me specifically but I saw it unfold before my eyes and I tell y'all that when I see something or when I experience something, you guys are gonna experience it. You guys are gonna be experiencing that with me. And this is a teachable moment for us all. So if you're doing something right now that's considered wrong, or if you're treating someone wrong in this moment, I want you to go back, reflect, and think about what really matters. Because sometimes, depending on the relationship, nothing is bigger than that relationship sometimes the idea of what's going on that's causing you to be upset is really not that big of a deal when you compare it to what that relationship is if that person was gone tomorrow how would you really feel about how you treated them or what you said to them the last thing that you said how would you feel would you feel good about it would you regret it what would you do what would you really do in that case? 
So I really want you to think about that. And I want you to acknowledge the fact that from now on, that's the way that we're gonna live life. Because as alphas, we don't run our lives by emotions. We just run our lives. And people are meant to emulate us because we are the alphas of the group. We are the leaders of the group. We do not emulate, they emulate us. So keep that message strong in your hearts and know that I'm here for you. And I want y'all to live life. And life demands results. So what do your results say about you?